this is nostalgic. Um, a video in my room? That I said I wasn't going to do a video in my room anymore? Actually, occasionally I will do one in here. A lot of the VR stuff I'm going to do in here. But today, I'm doing something a little different. And I'm in my room because the thing that I'm going to show you is meant for my room. I wanted to unbox it in here. We have the Creative Gigaworks T40, ser T40 Series 2 speakers. And we have two sets of the T20s. You bought one for the workstation that is in the other room where the theater stuff is at. We don't use it for the theater stuff, but we use it for that machine. And we also have one on the streaming setup at the, at the uh, green screen that we use occasionally when we're not using headphones. And so what happened is, is we really liked the Tiger, really liked the T20s. We loved the sound of these because the T20s, they had some pretty deep bass. He was impressed and he's not, he's not easy to impress when it comes to audio. But he is the, the audio guy around here. He's the one who set up the whole uh, surround sound system for our theater in the other room. And so he really liked the sound of the T20s, which is the s smaller version of these. And I saw the T20s, and not, not specifically this one. But I saw the T20s years ago, or a predecessor to these. Years and years ago when I used to work for CompUSA. And these were set up to, not these, but the, the speakers were set up on a Mac in the Apple section. And the audio quality, I was just blown away by how good they sounded without having a subwoofer. These do not have a subwoofer. These are uh, just two speakers. They have a bass hole at the top and some serious air comes through these when some bass is playing. We have a, a retro uh, console with thousands of games on it in the other room and we hook these speakers up to it and we're getting there and we're, we're playing like Super Metroid or we're playing some of the the, a lot of the Super Nintendo games were really bass heavy and you were just feeling just air just rushing out of that bass hole it was just pounding bass in a lot of games uh, on that on that machine and these sound absolutely great absolutely great so I wanted to unbox this in here show you exactly what comes with this and it's a surprising amount that they give you. Uh, first, let's get the accessories box out. Pull out the speakers. And of course, the accessories box is paid. Lovely. always have this handy. If I'm going to do these videos like this, I should always have this handy. There we are. Alright. First off, screws. These are important for the base. Not bases and boom 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 base. But uh, you'll, you'll see in a moment. The cable that connects between your PC or whatever device you're connecting these to can come off the speaker. I like that. I absolutely hate it when this wire is directly connected to a speaker because if something happens to the wire, you're screwed. You have to buy a new set of speakers. So this, you have to, you can replace this or you can get a longer one if you need one. I like that. Uh, you also get this. This is a Y adapter that goes from headphones, stereo headphones to RCA left and right, red and white adapters. Okay, this is 
these are the bases. Pull these out. These are what hold up the speaker. They have some protective plastic on them, on the edges. Pull that off in a second. Then in this box, we get the power brick. Yes, this thing has a chunky power brick. Look at this. A chunky power brick to power these speakers. Uh, these speakers can put up, put out some pretty good sound. I mean, they're good enough to use for every day. If you plug it, if you have a TV that has a headphone audio out in the back, you can plug these in and just use these instead of a sound bar or a surround, or a surround system if you don't have the room in your uh, in your home or apartment. And then. This is just your average, non-polarized power connector. Just your your average, unpolarized power connector. And now, the speakers themselves. All nice and wrapped in bubble wrap, which I will pop later. This is the left speaker. Actually, no, the right speaker with volume control, which is also on and off, treble and bass. Uh, you also get a line in and a headphone out jack on this. On the back, you got your power, Got your port for your other speaker, and then you got the port. And you got the port that goes to your PC or whatever the audio source is going to be on us. And this this is a tall. This is a tall speaker. This this thing is just big. This thing is just huge. And on the bottom, on the bottom is a mount point and. This, this is this, the same kind of mount point that you would see on, I think, that you could mount to a tripod. So these can be mounted onto tripods if you wanted to. You could do that. You could mount these on the tripods. So let us pull out the other speaker. And the other one is pretty simple. It doesn't have anything complex to it. What I don't like about this is that the cord is permanently connected to this one. I would have preferred this to be removable, replaceable, because if anything happens to this cord, you gotta replace the entire speaker. Well, you gotta replace the entire set of speakers and these are cheap. They're like a hundred and something bucks on Amazon. Now the front grill, that will come off and you can see the two figures in the tweeter. And the tweeter is not just for show, it's actually real, it actually works. Most speakers, the tweeter is just for show. There's the base port on the top. And then the these mount to the bottom like so with a screw oh look at that the other way these mount to the bottom with a screw that came in the other bag and it's not thumb screws it's a Phillips screw so have a screwdriver handy for when you want to put those on and that's it that's the that is the whole set. The Creative Gigaworks T40 Series 2. 
and the, the sound awesome they sound great uh, it's gonna sound great here in my room me doing uh, video playing games and stuff we have the little brother of this again in this in the streaming room I connect up my headphones to these so I can control the audio um, very well three drivers base port I mean it's a hundred that's about under a hundred and eighty dollars for these so they're actually worth getting and you don't have to have a subwoofer down under your desk which I've been wanting to get rid of that thing I, I like how it sounds the subwoofer but I have been wanting to get that out of the way so I can stretch my feet out while I'm playing games right now I can't because it's in the way and because of where I've got my speakers I can't comfortably put them anywhere so yeah great um they're say they're there for professionally designed for uh, MTM speaker systems and for, for studio monitors but they sound better I've I've messed with monitor headphones and I've uh, heard some monitor speakers and they work really good with bass these are good with bass these have good bass Anyway, I have been Mike the Zorch. This has been the first unboxing video I've ever done on this channel. Holy crap. I will see you next time. There will be more content. Also, a lot. there won't be too much here in my room. Most of it will be in the other room. Uh, I will be doing some Star Citizen stuff because CitizenCon is coming up and just another day actually I think it starts Friday and continues Saturday so we're gonna be watching the panels and I'll possibly streaming some Star Citizen uh, as well uh, also I got to get off of my very wide ass get my exercise bike out of the closet here set it up so that uh, I can start streaming bike with Mike again and how that's going to work is I'm going to do video reactions, I'm going to play some games, maybe some retro games, and maybe some, some other stuff. A, a variety of different things. It's going to be different every time. Um, I'll be playing some stream beats off of Spotify uh, for the music and everything. So it's going to be interesting. It's going to be a little fun. So I'll bring you along for the ride. I'm, I would be doing it for exercise and stuff. Uh, I have, we have, me and Tiger have started another channel called Will and Mike. And we're following our keto adventure. And I've got to get another, we have another video of that that needs to go up. We've been doing shorts daily on that channel. Uh, covering our progress and, um, so you can get updates on exactly how that's going. Anyway, I have been Mike Resorch. I will see you next time in the next video.